stay pain. Only day of life. Where to, feisty girl? Uh, apartment 301. 301? Are you sure? Okay. All right. Enjoy your day, 301 girl. Feisty 301 girl. Joyce. My name is Joyce. Well, Joyce, I'm Carl. Carl Cooper. You know, I'm actually in the middle of something right now, but uh, can I take your number or something? Unless you want to join, of course. I, I don't think your moaner over there would find that offer appealing. Now, don't worry about her. If you're actually interested, can we work something out? dreams, little boy. Don't make your playdate wait if you don't want to miss your five-star review on Tinder, tough guy. Are you that fucking horny? The fucking delivery man? with someone else tonight, maybe try again tomorrow. Excuse me? I have zero interest in Carl. That is the first time I've heard that. <laughs> Exhibit A. But girls love boxers, especially this one, so if you're not one of them, then why are you breaking down my door in the middle of the night? That's the reason. The constant moaning. I just moved in next door. Oh, then this is all your fault then. He's making all the noise to piss you off. What? Yeah, I've never seen him put this much effort into a girl before, like ever. Wow, I'm flattered. Enjoy the show. Oh, Carl, 
You're so big. Not impressed. Lousy acting. I like you. You're funny. I'm Andy, Carl's roomie. I'm Joyce. I live in 302. Well, nice to meet you, Joyce. Do you think you can keep your loud dog quiet tonight? Ha. <laughs> I'll try. Good. See you. See ya. Buddy, you are head over heels for her. What? To that, to that stuck up girl? Are you, what are you talking about? Back off. Why do you keep pushing me away? You have feelings for me. I can feel it. I don't want to play your games. Where did you get this? Just a gift from a sweet lady. Let me go. So hard to leave a monster. You cannot fall in love again. Are you okay? I heard a... Uh... I was having a nightmare. Treat me to a glass of wine and I'll protect you from the monsters underneath your bed. Maybe another time. Six months in jail for violent conduct against his dad? Carl's a domestic abuser? What is wrong with you, Joyce? Hey guys, what's up? Hey, uh, sorry, I'm in a rush. What'd you do? Me? Nothing, man, I, I don't know what's up with her. Well, you obviously did something. Okay, go, fix it. All right, I'll go prove it to you. Domestic abuser. I saw your file, Carl. Seems I'm stupid enough to fall for a monster not once but twice. What is wrong with me?
Hey, Joyce? Andy? Hey. Uh, you okay? You look like you're on another planet. I'm curious, Andy. Why do you live with Carl? You two are so different. Yeah, he can be a serious jerk, but Carl, he's not the cold-hearted bad guy you think he is. We all know what he's been through. Free time later tonight, don't you? Hi, Mrs. Smith. Don't forget to come over for dinner tonight. Yeah, I'm on my way. Hello. Hi. Oh, it's so good to see you. Oh, thank you for having me. Well, thank you for coming. You come on. Come on inside. I just need another minute. You make yourself at home, okay? okay? Thank you. What are you doing in Mrs. Smith's home? So you're finally willing to talk to me. Dinner's ready. Come and sit down. I'm good at making Chinese food. This is just my humble way of thanking you for everything you've done for me. But there's no need. It's what I'm here for. It's really no problem, Mrs. Smith. You can remind Peter that I got a fist with his name on it if he dares to touch you again. You helped her? place, my dear. Carl is like a crab. He's tough on the outside, but soft and yummy on the inside. Isn't this nice? Good-looking couple walking underneath the stars. A couple? And what stars? Mind your own damn business, or I will. Is that blood? How could this be? Could it be? Look, whoever it was, they may have broken into your apartment. Let me just check it out, make sure everything's all right. Get hurt. I'm not gonna let you push me away again, Joyce. I care for your safety. Please, be careful. I fight for a living, Ken 301. 